Yes, astrology for me where it's growing into is exactly that. It's not something that we just sit down in order that somebody tells us and assures us, you know, who we are and then gives us permission to be an angry person or gives us permission to have a sexual problem or gives us permission to have been raped or giving us permission to be an arrogant person and be just like somebody that's just very sarcastic like all these are traits to understand but ultimately even if you are having that quality even that like there is an inner choice like should you react to that impulse or could you be quiet and when we are more quiet because we have a lot of peace within ourselves then we're becoming more and more open to a more subtle quality and I call this like falling in tune or in alignment with a bigger body or you could say space the earth like your universal quality and I think that's what um, all this spiritual tradition actually moving us towards like any practice of awareness is helping us to calm down and it's not to kill the ego or shut our minds down like that's a very you know like again we are trying to kill something or to get rid of something so again we are trying really hard and we are again trying to do something but actually to become aware that there is this capacity within us you know that we are trying but becoming aware of it means this non-reactivity. We are aware of it, we are not feeding it with energy, we are not trying something and because we are aware of it, we actually, the, the quality in itself can disappear because it's acknowledged, it's accepted, but we are not trying it. And that needs time to cultivate that. And I think just astrology is an amazing forum to, to show us straight into our face with words how do we deal with life? How do we react? How do we make things more complicated? Why do we face the same issues again and again? While meditation is much more and zoom out, let go of everything. And I think a lot of time that's not working anymore because astrology actually is much more in daily life while meditation is trying to point us to something we cannot grasp mentally and I just see myself like I'm a Western person my mind is very active so I'm trying to understand so trying to explain me something I cannot understand with my mind is ultimately not working so I think astrology is really a great tool to give myself meaning and purpose and an understanding but at the same time telling me like hey but this is not the ultimate, like this helps you as a step to go further, but even that you have to let go. And I think it's this art of giving you a support while not telling you this is the solution and you just have to believe in this one thing and everything else is wrong. It's like there is this, this is true for you right now in this moment in order to grow and then you have to let go again. So it's a much more gentle way rather than meditation or this transcendence. And it's the same with any spiritual, um, experience or a drug like this ultimate reality can be a one rocket shot to experience but then to really integrate in your life it's much more difficult